Don't let your guard down. I guess that was a turn of his. There's another poor victim. Damn it. When will this stop? Are you truly going to abandon them? It's dangerous here. You should get back. Shades are even attacking the village now. And armored ones, no less. This village of yours seems to be changing for the worse. It's all the Shadow Lord's fault. That one day changed everything. Five long years. It's been five years since they took my sister. I spent every waking moment searching for her, but all I found is heartache and despair. This world is winding down. Between the Shades and the Black Scrawl, there won't be anyone left soon. My life now, and my purpose, is hunting Shades. Someday I'll find a clue that will lead me to the Shadow Lord. I believe that. I have to. Popola called for you, yes? Yeah. Lost a good deal of time with that. Yeah. <laughs> Best to leave her be.
I think I'm beginning to understand. Climate change wasn't the cause of our woes. It was only a symptom. The real trouble started when something terrible came down from the sky. It seems that this event turned the world into a metropolis of salt. I guess they're talking about how most of the city sunk into the ocean? Look at you. I think you've grown even taller. Yeah? It's hard for me to tell anymore. But you haven't changed a bit, Popola. What's your secret? I see your flattery skills are improving as well. No, it's true. You look the same as the day I first met you. Okay, now you're just embarrassing me. Anyway, here. This is from Emil. Well, well. Perhaps the time has come to save Kaine. I take it this means you'll be leaving the village. Sorry. I know the shades have been rough lately. It's okay. Go. Just be careful. Welcome, sirs. Master Emil is waiting in his chambers. Oh, hey there, guys. Hey, Emil. It's been a while. And, uh, you haven't aged a day. Oh, uh, yeah. I'm sort of special that way. Huh, fair enough. Anyway, I hear you found a lead on undoing the petrification curse. Yes! Take a look at this! section of this manor called the planning room, and I think... You think this room will let you harness the ability to control all forms of magic, correct? Actually, yeah. Or even if it doesn't, something there might point us in the right direction. So where is this planning room? There's an entrance in the courtyard. It's not far. Good. Let's go find it. This room truly contains the power to control all magic. I can use it to cure my eyes. 
If we could heal both Emil and Kaine at once, it would be quite an achievement. Two birds with one, um, stone, as they say. Wow, Vice. I didn't think you cared. Perhaps this tone is getting a bit sappy in his old age. Here somewhere. Is this it? Warning. This facility. I can't read the rest. Something about a seal? If someone bothered to attach a warning to this room, I doubt they will appreciate us forcing our way inside. Ah! Uh, Emil, you okay? What's wrong? Nothing. It's nothing. I'm fine. Something is amiss with Emil. Take care not to stray too far from him. Right. Falling behind. used to be some manner of magical research facility. This must have been where I was... <sighs> Emil! All... all 
We'll be okay. We need to keep going. Sorry for the trouble. falling behind.
Project number six. So this was some sort of weapons laboratory? What the hell was going on down here? <sighs> what was I doing here? I have doubts as to whether or not Emil will be able to continue. I... I'm fine. Let's just go. is falling behind. Sure you're okay, Emil? I'm a... weapon? What does that even mean? What am I? It appears he's trying to remember something. You're gonna be fine. Am I? Am I really? Your past makes no difference. We'll support you no matter what. At any rate, you would hardly be the first member of our merry band to have issues.
I remember now. I remember everything. We used to be humans. Normal humans. Just a bunch of regular human kids like you'd see anywhere. And then, we came here. They wanted to turn us into weapons. So they used magic to perform terrible experiments on us. Eventually they succeeded. They managed to create a perfect weapon. The name of that weapon was Number Six. But soon they lost control of Number Six, and the experiment was deemed a failure. They had to create a weapon that could petrify Number Six and seal it away. So they created me. I'm Number Seven. I'm... I'm a weapon. Weapon or no weapon, you're still a meal to us. Thank you. This is number six. She's my sister. This thing is alive? My sister is the greatest weapon ever made, and... Yes, go on. And with her power, I could eradicate my petrification curse. So what's the plan here? First, you have to promise me something. Hmm? If my sister somehow manages to swallow me up... My original self becomes lost. I'm afraid I may try to hurt all of you. And if that happens... No, wait! Then I want you to kill me. You have to get him out of there, now! I'm on it. We're not gonna lose anyone else. There's still time to save him! I know there is! Magic is the only way to damage this one. This thing's way too quick! Such attacks will hurt Emil as well. How is magic any different? He is highly resistant to it. Then let's kill that thing with magic and get Emil out of there! Emil, we're coming for you! Come back to us. Thank <laughs> you. 
Halua. Emil, wake up. Halua, I... It's okay. It's over now. I'll always be watching over you, Emil. Thank you, Halua. Are you all right? I'm still alive. I feel my sister's power inside me. I think I can control my abilities now. Yes, we're all quite pleased. Now get out here already. Just a second. I can't... I can't see very well. Ugh. No, don't! Don't look at me! Emil, what's wrong? Stay back! Good God! <laughs> through a lot but my my body i can't stand to be with you when i look like this what i tell you we're here for you no matter what <laughs> Can you see my face? You... You look just like I thought you would. You look really cool. Right. I think I'm okay now. If this is how I look now, then so be it. I was terrified at first. But it's not all bad, you know? I have the magic I wanted. And I can use it to bring Kaine back to us. Emil. We should hurry. She's waiting. I sure hope seeing me doesn't petrify her. You know... In fear? I see this transformation has not stolen your terrible sense of humor. <laughs> <laughs>